Hello, friends, fellow star seeds, and light workers. I am Julie Joy of the Young Light Workers with a message from the Ninth Dimensional Arcturian Council as channeled by Daniel Scranton for March 30th, 2020. And the title of this message is, This Isn't About Light Forces Versus Dark Forces. They begin, Greetings, we are the Arcturian Council. We are pleased to connect with all of you. We are very well informed about regarding everything and everyone there on Earth. We understand why things happen the way that they do, and we want to be very clear about something. It is always consciousness that is creating, using vibration. That's the reason why everything that is happening has been happening, and it's the reason why everything that is not happening has not been happening. Now you live in a physical realm on a physical planet, and so you look for a physical cause. You look for responsible parties. You look for who did what and why, and it is your right to do so. But change comes through the evolution of consciousness, and you are living in a time when there is a great opportunity to evolve. There is a great opportunity in front of you to work on yourselves, clear past life and current life trauma, and help one another in your times of need. And so we want you to know that there are always going to be forces of light and forces that are playing the role of the dark. But even those forces are really coming from the light as we are all source energy beings. We also want you to know that in the universe right now, which we are all a part of, there is much more light present. The light far outweighs the dark. And we also want you to know that this truth that we are giving you now has not always been the case in this universe. We have all surpassed that tipping point and we did so several years ago as a universal collective. You who are receiving this message are a part of the force that represents the light. You are recognizing yourselves as source energy beings and you also recognize that you have an enormous amount of help coming from other beings representing the light, including ourselves. Therefore, we recommend that you do not put your focus on the dark minority. We recommend that you do not give away your power by wondering what they are up to. We recommend that you look for more opportunities to band together and shine that light that comes from within each and every one of you. We also recommend that you acknowledge how powerful you are when you tune into the light within you. Instead of turning over every rock that you can find looking for the dark and trying to figure out their agenda. Now is a time to open yourselves up to the help that you have coming in as well because those of us in the higher realms are amplifying the light and only those who are looking for that light are going to receive it. You are the ones to remind those who are playing the role of the dark forces that they are in fact also source energy beings and that the light within them can never be extinguished. That is a big part of the role of light worker at this time. We are the Arcturian Council and we have enjoyed connecting with you. This was channeled by Daniel Scranton. His website is danielscranton.com and I also saw this message on the sananda.website as well as voyagesoflight.blogspot.com. I am Julie Joy of the Young Light Workers. Thank you for listening to this enlightening message. I've never really thought about it that way.